with y'all boys, man. Hope y'all feeling good, because I'm feeling good. It's like now I'm feeling great, so I hope y'all feeling great. So today, we got a little fun topic, all right? So we about to be talking about anime. So, you know, anime, if y'all don't know, if y'all know me, bro, I'm not, I don't even watch TV type shit, but if I am, I'm either watching basketball, I'm either watching motivational videos, you know, that's what I really, you know, spend my time watching, you know, trying to upgrade myself um, as a person, you know, learning about money, um, learning about business, whatever it may be, or learning about myself, you know what I mean, watching spiritual videos, whatever it may be, or if not that, I'll be watching anime, bro. I used to watch TV. I don't watch no type of TV no more. TV is bullshit, all right? I really don't even watch NBA no more because NBA is bullshit, really, too. I really only care about the playoffs now. College is cool, but it's like some games is cool, but some games, most games, it's not the same. You feel what I'm saying? So nowadays, you know, if you catch me watching TV at any time, which is very rarely, it's going to be probably anime. You feel me? So why do I personally feel that anime is better than regular TV, right? Now, like I said, I used to watch TV back in the day, you know? I used to watch all TV shows, but then I went into, you know, obviously Netflix, Hulu, that vibe, you feel me? You know, I was watching some shows, you know, I was, you know, probably what you do, binge watching shit before I was on my on my shit, on my grind. But, um, you know, I, 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 I've watched a few good shows. You know, one of my favorite actual TV shows was, is Game of Thrones. Um, if you haven't tuned into that, tune into that show. It's a long series, but I, I assure you it's worth it. I fuck with Game of Thrones crazy. I fuck with The 100. Um, I fuck with Power. Um, I fuck with a few shows. Like, those are some of my, like, top shows. Um, and then I got movies, but movies is different. We're really just talking about anime compared to TV, right? So why do I feel like t anime is better than TV? Because it's a few reasons, right? So the first one is really just like, first off, get that image out your head that, that anime is only watched by nerds, anime is only watched by weird kids, you know, weird dudes. Um, get that out, get that ego out the side, bro. Get that out your head, bro. You know, I remember there was once a time where it's not as much now, but I'm, there was once a time where society painted a picture that if you was watching anime, you're a dork, this and that, bro. Don't get that shit out your head, bro. Get that out your head first and foremost. Okay, second thing is, um, you know, anime, like, when you really tune into anime, really watch it, but you're not going to want to not tune in. Like, you, like, the actual emotion, you feel more emotion. You feel more connected to the character, right? You know, you feel more into the show, right? You feel like you really just want to keep watching. And the reason for it is just because... You know, it's 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 the fact that it's an anime. It's the fact that it's animated um, movements, animated characters, right? So their reaction and their emotion and, and, you know, how they carry themselves and stuff that happens, you know, it's stuff that us humans, we could do. I mean, we felt most of these things. We acted, we can, we, we could see ourselves acting these ways. But if we did that shit, nigga, that we, we, we would be looked at. It was, it was weird. Like, we would laugh at it if we seen it in a TV show, like, an anime character could literally lash out, start crying out of nowhere. And, like, you could feel it more than, like, you know, if a, if a regular, you know, actor on TV just started crying out of nowhere. You start laughing, like, what the heck going on? You feel what I'm saying? You know, anime can get away with all that stuff. Like, you know, awkwardness. Like, there's no awkwardness in anime. You know what I mean? People could be staring at each other, you know what I mean? You know, an anime character be looking at a girl like, oh, I want her, this and that. You know what I mean? And in our head, we're like, yo, you know, like, real people could be like this. But it's like, if you've seen that in a TV show, it's awkward. Like, you'd be like, yo, what's going on? Like, this is funny. Like, what am I watching? But in anime, it's like, it's not like that. You feel what I'm saying? It's like, it's different. You know, you feel more connected. Like, you know, when an anime character could bust out just yelling out of nowhere, just, ah, you feel what I'm saying? Just yelling. Like, if a regular, if you see that on TV, you're going to be like, yo, bro, what is this, bro? You're going to be like, yo, like, it, it's not as, like, it's not as natural to see something like that. Like, you, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, and it's not real, like, you know, actors are actors, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, there's great actors that connect uh, huge with their, you know, their character and the role that they play. You know, like Denzel, um... Uh, Tom Cruise, or, or I think I said his name right. I hope I did. Um, you know what I'm saying? Like, there's great actors out there that that feel me that that, that really be connected with their character. I'm like, damn, bro, he's killing it. You know, like you know what I'm saying? Like Will Smith is one of the ones up there too. You know what I mean? But it's just like 
we've see, we know who these people are. You feel what I'm saying? Like we've seen them in different, you know what I mean, movies, you know, TV shows. We've seen them all over the place. Anime is distinct, right? Every anime is different. You're not gonna see Naruto on Dragon Ball Z. You feel what I'm saying? You're not gonna see Naruto on Attack on Titan. I mean, you're not going to see Naruto on One Punch. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's distinct. So they're more, like, connected to who that character is. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, like, the character development and, and how he acts, it's, like, it's strictly, like, you could feel it more because it's him. Like, it's not, like, it's Naruto. All right, we see him in another show acting a different way. Like, you could see Denzel in one movie, one show, and then you could see him acting another way in another show. It's, like... He great at what he do, but it's like, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying. So, um, that's really the first one. Like, you really going to feel it when you when you watch it. You going to feel it. You feel what I'm saying? It's like, yeah, this is real. Like, you know what I mean? You going to feel the emotion. You going to feel all that stuff. Right? That's really the first thing. You know, it's more entertaining to me. Two, um, character development. Character development, storyline, that's a big thing when you watch the TV. No one wants to watch something that really don't got no character development, no storyline. You know, there's no real meaning behind it. You know, that's why at the end of this, I'm going to recommend my top three animes that I feel like uh, someone who's never watched anime before should definitely tune into, um, you know, to get their feet wet, to really know about, you know, what anime is like and, 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 to, and to like it for yourself. Um so, you know, character development, you know, when when you see an anime, bro, like, the character development in the anime is crazy. You know what I mean? Like, you know, they'll go from being weak, you know, they have a drive but just don't have the skill. You know what I mean? Just, you know, just a whole bunch of things, you know, going from a good guy to a bad guy, bad guy to a good guy, you know, a bunch of stuff. And you really get to see them develop. Like, it's not just like... Oh, you know, um, one little thing happens and now they change. You know what I mean? Like, they really change, like change, change. You get to see it. Their battles, their darkest moments, their their worst times. You know, and then it gets to resonating with you. You feel what I'm saying? That's another thing I'm gonna get into in a, in a little bit. But you know, you really get to see them just excel, become a new person almost, and. You know, it feels good when you see that. It feels good because it makes you believe that you could do it for yourself. So, I mean, honestly, get into the next thing. Um, and, and, and actually, before I get into the next thing, I mean, TV shows, they got that. But like I said, it's very few that really got it the way anime got it. And there's so many animes to really choose from to see it. You know what I mean? There's so many great animes. You know, TV shows, it's like, it's really only a few that's really, you know, like that. And if you think about with TV shows, it's like, the actors got to get paid, you know, the actors got to be satisfied, you know, they're, they're, if, they're, if their role in the show is not the biggest role, but they're getting no freaking play, they're going to be tight. So they're going to have to add them in a little bit. Like, little stuff like that is what affects TV shows that, that really doesn't matter for anime. Like, a character that nobody cares about in anime is not going to be like, yo, I need more, I need more, I need more, I need more play. I need, I need more movie time, bro. I need more shine. I need more camera time. Like, they're not going to say that, bro. They could choose how much time they could give them. You feel what I'm saying? And most of the time, like, the character that don't really get that much time, we don't really care because they're not important anyway. You feel what I'm saying? You know how, like, when in a TV show, there's a character that you just, like, that should have been dead that's still in the show? Like, they not dead because they want to get their paper still. You feel what I'm saying? So it's like, that little stuff right there, it's just like, it's different, bro. It, it, it has anime on a higher pedestal, right? The next thing, the third thing is, you know, when you really watch anime, especially, you know, the ones I'm going to suggest at the end, um, you know, you really get to see, you know, character development to the max. And it really resonates with you. Like, if you watch a certain anime that I'm going to recommend to you and you don't look at it and think like, damn, like, like mentally when you watch it, you're like, yo, like, I should be working this hard. I should be thinking like this. You know what I mean? I should be trying to better myself like this. Like, he done went through that, 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 that. I only got to go through this, and I'm not trying to better myself. Like, you feel what I'm saying? You going to feel it. Like, back when I was in, like, 7th, 8th grade, you know, I was in, like, 8th grade. Yeah, I was getting ready to go to high school, and I used to be a little chubby nigga. I ain't going in front. I used to be a little chubby nigga. I, was, I didn't look like how I look now. And basically, I was about to go into high school, and I was like, yo, bro, like, I really got to get on my shit. Like, I ain't trying to go into high school looking like a big nigga. You know, I was fucking with the females at that time. I wanted to get some females. You feel me? So I was like, yo, I can't be looking like this. And I used to literally every single day, every single day, 
I used to wake up. This is the summer before freshman year. I used to wake up, right? Shower, do whatever I gotta do. Hop on anime, straight on anime, right? I'm watching Naruto, right? I'm watching Naruto. That I watched Naruto that whole summer. That was the first time I ever finished the whole Naruto series, right? Shippuden, everything. Every single day, I was on that, right? And after every episode, I told myself, all right, after every episode, I'm busting out 20 push-ups. After every every single episode, I was watching like four or five episodes a day, my nigga. So I, every, every episode, boom, 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 20 push-ups, right? I didn't care. I was like, bro, if I could sit on my ass and watch this show all day, which I'm going to do, I can at least, after the episode's over, bust out some push-ups. And that's what I told myself. And it's because I was watching Naruto, too. Like, he was grinding. He was working hard. He was trying to reach his goals. I was like, bro, if he could do that, I could do it. Like, mentally, I was like, bro, me and Naruto are in the same boat. You know what I mean, we we trying to push for a goal. I'm trying to lose weight. He trying to become an Hokage. So boom, boom, boom. After every episode, right? And then I made my I made sure that what a specific time before uh, during the day I would work out, right? So I do a little thirty minute workout, right? Do some ab push ups. I mean, excuse me, ab work. You know, um, you know, um, whatever I got to do. I was doing like workouts, little workouts in my room, calm shits, really. But it was helping me out. Right. And I was doing that while I was watching the show. So it was like it was cool for me. I was watching my show, also working on myself. Right. So and then I dedicated a time like at night to always play ball every single day at night because I was playing ball back then a lot, too. So I was I was dedicated time to play ball for like a good two, three hours. Right. And then I came home, hopped on the sticks. I was getting everything in one. You know, right. So right off the wake, anime push ups, certain time it hit like maybe two o'clock. Let's say two o'clock. I said, all right, it's time to work out. Boom, jumping jacks. Boom, boom, uh, ab workout. You feel what I'm saying? And then it hit like eight, was it like eight? It was like maybe, maybe like six, I think. Six o'clock. Boom, go to the, go to the, go to the courts. Walk to the courts, go play ball. Now I'm getting exercise in, my push ups in, and I'm getting some cardio in. I'm playing ball, right? At the time, I really didn't realize how good I was doing it for myself, but I was just doing it just to do it. I was like, yo, I gotta get active. I gotta start doing something because I'm trying to lose some weight. Right? Then I came home, hopped on the sticks for the night, and I was cooling. Right? Hopped on the sticks till about 3 a.m. <laughs> Feel me? That little nigga shit. But that's what I was doing that whole time. I ended up slimming down. I lost a lot of weight. I went into freshman year looking like a much better person. And it was because I was also watching Naruto. I was seeing him grow. You feel what I'm saying? So when you watch, you know, these animes, bro, you gonna, it's going to make you want to work hard. It's going to make you like, damn, like. He going through that. He going through this. He going through that. I got to do my thing. You feel what I'm saying? So that's really that's really that. And then the last thing with anime, it's like, it's like, you know, like, you know, when you watch TV, like there's fights and shit like that, like it's cool and all, but when you see anime fights, you know, how they just use their power, you know, how they can just do certain things, you're just like. Damn, like, what if we could do that? And I ain't gonna say too much about it, but we fuck around, fuck around, can you just gotta unlock your powers? But listen, like, watching that shit, bro, putting it all together, like the action in it, you know, the the emotion in it, right? The mental toughness in it, because it's gonna become help you become a mentally tougher person when you watch it. Everything put together, it just tops every show. Right, there's some shows that are tough. I'm not gonna lie. I told you there's some shows that are tough, but I've seen a lot of shows that that really just you know it's it's not the same. It's not the same as when when animes and there's so many different animes for you to watch, so many different animes. So that's why if you see me now, you know I watch some shows if it's tough. Like 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 I said, I I used to watch Game of Thrones. I used to watch Power. Power is trash now, honestly. Um, I used to watch uh, what's that? I'm trying to think of that one show on Hulu. Um. Snowfall, Snowfall, tough, tough. If you tune into Snowfall, that's tough too. Like there's some tough shows, but I take an anime over over all them shits. Anime over all them shits. Fuck, fuck you talking about. But you know that's really how I feel. Like anime is better than TV. You can you know leave in the comments what you think. You know, but I'm gonna tell y'all three animes that I suggest y'all to watch if y'all never watched anime before. Number one, Naruto. Straight like that. Number one, Naruto. All right, you know, if, for my ones that's watching Naruto, you already know the vibes. If you haven't, Naruto, number one, right? Naruto's the best show I've ever seen in my life. Straight like that.
So that's number one. And not just Naruto on Netflix. I'm talking about Naruto Shippuden too, my nigga. If you just see Naruto on Netflix, you ain't really watch Naruto. So watch Shippuden too. All right. So that's the first one. Second one, I would say is Death Note. Death Note is a, is, is, is a good show. Death Note's a cool show. Um, it's short. It's not too long. Um, and you know, just the 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 animosity between L and and Light. Um, you know, it's a good show and, and really leads you like, that's another thing. And, and like TV shows, it's almost like, you know, who's going to come out on top. Anime, sometimes you really just don't know. <laughs> like they be, they be making it seem like you really, like you really just don't know sometimes. Like you got to be like, damn, yo, what's about to happen for real, for real. And that's why it's, it's goaded. It's goaded. And the last one I would suggest is, um, Attack on Titan. Um, Attack on Titan is more like a recent show. Um, it's more like a recent show that that um I mean it's not really recent but it's like on the newer generation of of anime but it's cool it's it's easy to catch on it's so cool I haven't finished it but I do like it it's cool I think you know someone who's never seen anime will fuck with it um and you could hop in it and like it and and you know I know some people who are watching it who never seen even Naruto and they fuck with it so if you fuck with it you gonna fuck with Naruto and Death Note for sure for sure so um Attack on Titan is cool too definitely um. And it's newer, so it's like you're gonna be able to, you know, be in a new community of that anime, of that anime. Like Naruto heads, we're on Boruto right now, so it's like you're gonna have to really catch up. I haven't even finished Boruto. I'm gonna keep it a rack stack. Um, I'm gonna have to finish that, but um, and catch up with that. But Naruto heads, like you know, you could get in the conversation with us, but it's like we don't, you feel me? We don't been seeing it, so it's like you're gonna have to catch up. You feel me? Um. And that's that. And then some runner-ups I got for y'all. Just some, you know, on the bubbles runner-ups. I got Hunter x Hunter. That's cool. Definitely. Definitely a cool show. Um, you know, my son, um, my son Gon and my son Kilua. <laughs> they tough. They tough, definitely. Um, and uh, runner-up, definitely like Dragon Ball Z. You know what I mean? But I'm not, I don't put Dragon Ball Z in the top three to really watch. Reasons why is because one, Dragon Ball Z has too many, like, like, you know how I said Naruto and the Naruto Shippuden? Dragon Ball Z has too many of those. Like, they have a show with with a series, straight Dragon Ball, when 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 Goku was a little nigga. Cool. It's, it's definitely good. And they got Dragon Ball Z. Feel me? That's where it's really at. Dragon Ball Z, that's where it's really at. Um, but then they had, like, Dragon Ball Z Kai for TV. Like, fuck that shit. Don't watch Dragon Ball Z Kai. Just watch Dragon Ball Z. But then they got like Dragon Ball GT. That shit is trash, nigga. Don't watch Dragon Ball GT. All right, that shit's not even part of really the storyline. Don't watch that shit. Um, then they got uh, Dragon Ball Super, um, which is cool. Dragon Ball Super is definitely cool. I fuck with Dragon Ball Z more, but Super is definitely cool. But the thing about Dragon Ball Z, it has too many like different like TV series. Like I don't really like that. Um, you know, it's a little too much in terms of that, but it's been a, a, around for the, a long time. So it's like the OG of anime. It's really like the OG. And it's like, a, you know, as a little nigga, it's like, a you know, for, for the fellas, it's like a must watch. I don't think females will really bang with it that much, but you could tune in. And the storyline ain't really, you feel what I'm saying? Like the character development is, eh. like there's only a few characters that really develop. You feel what I'm saying? But the character development is really, eh. it gets to a point where niggas is just shaking. You know what I mean? So it's like, I, I it's an OG. I fucking love it. You know what I mean? I love Vegeta. I love Goku. You know what I'm saying? But it's a eh, type of character development. It's really just, you want to see niggas fight type shit. Um, but if you really want to see like like a real anime, a real story, bro, Naruto, bro. Naruto. Like, straight like that, bro. Um, that's why when niggas tell me what's better, Naruto or Dragon Ball Z, bro. If you if you if you could make in that comparison, you really don't understand what you're watching. Naruto is easily better. Um, so that being said, bro, you know, let me know how y'all feel. You know, about anime. I love anime talk. We could talk about anime all day. I've seen a few of them. I definitely gotta watch more. Um, you know, like I said, I don't be having the same time on my hands as I used to. But you know, that's what what I'm creating for myself to have time to really watch every single anime that 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 there is. There's a lot that I want to watch. Like I seen um, um, uh, Yu Yu. Um, fuck is that shit called? Fuck. Wait, with my son Yusuke. You know, you know what I'm talking about. Um. Seen a little bit of Bleach, seen a little bit of One Punch, it's cool. Seen a little bit of um, My Hero, um, Academia, 
And that's cool. It started off cool, but you know, feel what I'm saying? You know, so I seen a few of them, you know, but the real OGs, the real righteous, you know, Naruto, um, Death Note, and Attack on Titan is cool, definitely. Um, but uh, like I said, tune in for yourself. See how you feel about it. Um, that's really why I feel like, you know, anime tops TV shows. That being said, bro, you know it's up, it's stuck. Keep taking care of yourselves. The more y'all take care of yourselves, take care of me. We are one. All right? I'm going to holler at y'all, boys. I'm out, boy.